Asia is rapidly becoming a hotspot, not only for tourists who are in search of new adventures and experiences, but also expats who would like to live outside their home countries. Asia is considered moderately safe, accessible, and most of all, affordable. Asia is a unique and vast culture melting pot that can appeal to anyone's taste. It promises the rewards of an exciting and affordable life. Whether you are looking for tranquil blue waters, giant waves for surfing, crowded shorelines, and sultry nights at a beach bar, or a laid back free of worries, there is always something for you. In this video, we are going to explore the best Asian countries for expats to live in. But first, a simple reminder on how to enter our brand new giveaway. We are giving away either an iPhone X Max, the new iPad mini, or a MacBook Pro. It's all your choice, so be sure to leave a like, comment the keyword, subscribe, and turn on notifications to enter this giveaway. It's really that simple. Let's start the list with Thailand. Thailand is one of the most popular countries for great living abroad, and it is consistently on the list of top destinations in the world. There are lots of reasons why a lot of people want to move to Thailand, and we are going to talk about them here. Expats who choose to move to Thailand enjoy a tropical climate all year round, get access to modern conveniences and comforts, and get a lot of value for their money. Exotic, modern, and ancient at the same time. This is where you will see people wearing the skimpiest bikinis at the beach, as well as orange robe monks collecting alms in tranquility at dawn. You will see huge and tall buildings in the country's capital in Bangkok, juxtaposed with ancient temples where you have to be modestly dressed to enter. Indeed, you will have a lifestyle similar to the West, but without the extra expense. Thai food is consistently ranked one of the best in the world, and its taste will tickle your taste buds and satisfy your palate. And bonus points if you enjoy spicy food. Don't forget to sample the ubiquitous pad thai, tom yam soup, and ko pad when you're in the country. And when you move there, you will have more dishes to look forward to. The Thai people are some of the friendliest in the world. They will welcome you with open arms and will be more than glad to help you should you need assistance. Although not everyone speaks English, you will be able to get by just fine. How would you like to go to the cinema to catch an English language film and then head to the beach for the weekend? And the beaches, we can't even begin to tell you just how incredible they are. Just imagine jagged limestone and long stretches of power powdery white sand beaches with turquoise waters. Although popular islands such as Phuket and Krabi have been run down by tourists in recent years, there are still plenty of other quiet and pristine places to enjoy. There is a whole range of lifestyle options for expats and on a budget of $2,000 a month, including rent, a couple can live quite comfortably. Some of the top places for expats are Chiang Mai, which has also become a haven for digital nomads, Koh Sami, a tropical haven, Bangkok, affordable and modern, Phuket, excellent for those who want to be spoiled with beaches, and Hao Hin, a relaxing seaside retreat. Let's move on to the Philippines. Still considered by many as Asia's hidden gem, the Philippines is a country where expats will be spoiled for choice with more than 7,100 islands to choose from. Even if you visit one island every year, you won't be able to see all of them in a lifetime. This tropical Asian country has a myriad of good things to offer, but everyone agrees that the best about it is the people. The Filipinos are a happy, family-oriented bunch who help one another when they are in trouble. And for the most part, people are not motivated by the cars they drive or the brands they wear. Although there are signs of things slowly changing, especially in major cities. Filipino hospitality is renowned the world over, and you will feel right at home in the country's vibrant culture. One of the things that expats find endearing about the Philippines. Of course, we also have to consider a lot of other things about the country, so let's move on. Anyone who has ever been to this part of Asia will tell you that you will get more for your money. Public transportation is among the lowest in the world. Services such as having your hair cut, getting household help, and getting your nails done are inexpensive. The same can also be said about renting a condo in the metropolis, as well as shopping for clothes and groceries. The job market in the Philippines is backed by a robust and sophisticated economy that is also one of the strongest in Asia. More investors are coming in. There is great interest in the economy and businesses are booming. It is also not surprising to see foreigners working in various industries, with some even holding key positions. It's not a secret that the Philippines is home to a plethora of gorgeous beaches, and the world's top island, Palawan, is located there. Every single region in the country boasts of islands with turquoise waters, gorgeous fiery sunsets, and long stretches of beaches with white powdery sand. Almost every country speaks English because it's also the national language, aside from Filipino. It is also the 
medium of communication in work and the academics, so you won't have any problem communicating with locals. Expats get to enjoy tropical weather all year long, so there is no excuse not to go to the beach. Speaking of stunning beaches, some of the top destinations are Bohol, El Nido, Siargio, Caramon, and Cebu. Some of the best cities for expats in the Philippines are Baguio, the summer capital where it's cool all year, Makati, the center of business and trade, Tagate, close to Manila but with pleasant weather and modern amenities, and Cebu, a thriving southern metropolis. Another place to move on to in Asia is Vietnam. Vietnam is increasingly becoming a popular option for expats who want to move to Southeast Asia. Just like Thailand and the Philippines, it offers variety. It boasts of mountainside terraces, tropical mangroves, as well as beautiful beaches. Most new expats settle in one or two of the major cities, Hanoi, located in the north, or Ho Chi Minh, located in the south. However, there are plenty of other choices too, such as Hoi An, a charming ancient city, and Da Nang, a booming beach resort with big casinos. Locals are one of the things that appeal to foreigners because they are friendly and open, both in large cities and smaller towns. Expats moving from Western countries, as well as progressive Asian nations such as South Korea and Japan, will find that the cost of living is extremely cheap. You can have a nice meal for under a dollar, ride a taxi for less than three dollars, and rent a nice apartment for about $150. That's a far cry from the money you have to spend in places such as Dubai and New York. Vietnam also offers a rich culture and interesting history. You will find hundred-year-old pagodas and remnants of the Vietnam War. Vietnamese cuisine is also delicious. Just take it from Anthony Bourdain, who has been to the country four times and featured it twice on his show, No Reservation. There is such a community of expats that are thriving in the country, especially in major cities such as Hanoi and Ho Chi Minh, and it is easy to find a network of like-minded individuals for expats to connect and become friends with. Some of the dishes which will send your taste buds in flights of fancy are pho, beef noodle soup, Bon Zio, a crispy crepe with shrimp, pork, and bean sprouts. Bon Mi, short baguette with pork and a variety of vegetables. Janung, a local version of chicken marinated in honey, then grilled over flaming barbecues. And Cafe Trung, Vietnamese coffee topped with soft, creamy, meringue like egg white foam. The country offers a host of options when it comes to selecting your preferred stomping ground. And while there are plenty of cities and towns scattered about, there are popular options for getting your feet wet. Ho Chi Minh, also known as Saigon, is the country's biggest city and has energy, bustle, and fun that is uniquely its own. Ho Chi Minh is to Vietnam what New York is to the USA. Hanoi has a more traditional and laid-back vibe with its old French Quarter. It has artistic hotspots, pagodas, markets, and music venues. Da Nang and Hoi An are significantly smaller but offer fresh seafood, plenty of fun in the sun and sand, and an endless array of craft markets. Last but not least on this list is Singapore. Singapore. The shimmering city-state is located at the southern tip of the Malay Peninsula and is a popular option for expats. A truly global city and a religious hub for many companies from all over the world, it also hosts the world's best airport, Shanghai Airport. One of its most iconic landmarks are the 50-meter-tall solar-powered trees, but Singapore also has aquariums, large shopping malls, rooftop bars, and amusement parks. Singaporeans generally speak good English, which is locally known as Singlish, so communication shouldn't be a problem. The transition into expat life should be easy, as the country is very westernized. You will often see locals wearing shorts, flip-flops, skirts, dresses, and all the latest fashion. However, Singapore is not cheap. It is consistently ranked as one of the top five most expensive cities in the world to live in. For context, an 8-inch pizza in Singapore costs $24, whereas in Italy, you only have to pay 8 to 10 euros, which is around $16. It may take a few months to set up a new life in Singapore, but with a large expat community, you will soon have a lot of friends. So there you have it, the best Asian countries for expats to live in. Make sure you research thoroughly before making the big move.